The Universal Basic Education Commission, UBEC, has disclosed the federal government to sponsor a total of 57.2 million naira to state for teachers' professional development program within the last 13 years. Executive Secretary of UBEC, Dr. Amid Boboi, made this known on Monday at the National Conference on Teacher Professional Development in Abuja. Baboy said the conference, which has its theme as transforming teacher professional development in Nigeria for improving learning outcomes and basic education, testified to federal government commitment to show up level of knowledge in the subsector. Correspondent Miriam Enakimian reports that the UBEC Executive Secretary lamented the poor learner proper ratio in Nigeria schools, saying such negative development has resulted in poor learning outcomes. Permanent Secretary, Federal Minister of Education, David Adijo, who declared the conference opened, expressed the readiness of the federal government to implement programs aimed at boosting learning outcomes in the school. The Director of Teachers Development of UBEC, Aleshi Olumayowa, who said in spite of the effort of the Commission at improving the capacity of teachers and managers, there are still many challenges facing teacher professional development implementation at basic education level. Adding that, as the regulator of the program in Nigeria, it behoves the Commission to review the UBE TBD implementation and work out strategies for improving it so that the objective of the UBEC program are achieved. The government through UBEC has contributed, as you have already heard earlier, the sum of 57 billion, 165 million, 751 naira, 616.12 as assistance to states for teacher professional development between 2009 and 2022. This is grossly inadequate to cover the training needs of the teachers. The states that are being assisted have come to depend largely on the federal government fund for their TPD with little or no contribution. And it's very important for the states also to realize this and for us to convince our executive governments that for teacher professional development to, to have traction and to be effective in Nigeria, the states need to contribute. It's not just the responsibility of the federal government in this arena. I think that what is embracing consistency and determination to improve the bedrock of our educational system. Whether we like it or not, the teacher remains the foundation of our educational system. I don't need to preach to the truth on this matter here. What is important is that over the years, we teachers and we students have benefited from the good teaching and value systems of our teachers, have neglected our teachers. The teachers themselves have neglected themselves and they are encouraging people to see teaching as a spectator profession. Because people graduate from school today, they don't get a job, a beggarly teaching job, what people want to do. They do it six, three months, their mind is never there. They don't develop the necessary lesson plan because their eyes are always outside. But the teacher is a profession, or teaching is a profession that requires a passion. No matter how you try to pick it, if you don't have a passion for teaching, you cannot cut it right. In spite of the efforts of the Commission at improving the capacity of teachers and managers, there are still many challenges facing teacher professional development implementation at basic education level. As a regulator of the program in Nigeria, it behoves the Commission to review the UBTPD implementation and work out strategies for improving it so that the objectives of the Universal Basic Education Program are achieved.